I realize people that they want to go out and enjoy our sunshine, but there are responsible ways to do this partying is not one of them. Now is not the time for the usual weekend get togethers on the water. Miami-Dade Mayor Carlos Jimenez closed down marinas in light of these videos of large crowds gathering at the Hallover Sandbar. Miami-Dade police will be out on the water and shutting down any parties. Today, local medical professionals are echoing that plea for more social distancing. In an open letter in the Miami Herald, 76 emergency room doctors, physician assistants, and nurses asked the people of Miami to help them by cutting down unnecessary contact. They write in part, quote, if people need to personally experience COVID-19 by having a loved one or close friend infected in order to take this crisis seriously, then it will be too late and we will suffer the full brunt of this epidemic. The worst case scenarios indicate that over a million Americans may eventually die of COVID-19 if we are unable to control its spread. The doctors who are on the front lines of this stress that the number of confirmed cases that are being reported isn't a true representation of what they're seeing in the hospitals. Those numbers just reflect how behind we are in testing. They highlight another misconception that young people are immune to the outbreak. Quote, young and otherwise healthy people are also becoming severely ill from COVID-19. This is not just a problem for the elderly and chronically ill. It is a dangerous threat to all of us. Now, the message from these medical professionals was simple. The quicker we adopt strict social distancing practices, the faster we can get back to our normal lives. Mike Cunio, CBS 4 News.